Coming up today on Better, an easy craft you can do at home with your kids. And it's perfect for fall and Halloween. Plus, big things happening at Foxwoods, from winning money to saving big, plus some singing superstars will tell you all about it. And we're attempting another recipe in under five minutes. How bad will we mess this one up? At least you'll be laughing. Your day is about to get better. Starting right now. So glad they Why found that, that clip. Just die. I don't know. I know it's just going to be on. Now it's on the show forever. So get used to it. Uh, but, happy Monday, happy first day of fall, everyone. Welcome <laughs> to Better Connecticut. I'm Kara Sutherland. Scott Haney here. 3:50 in the morning. I was up. I looked at the clock. It was 3:40, and then I looked again. It was 3:53. I wanted to be up and alert and a, a, like a cognizant of the fact that fall was taking place at 3:50, and I missed it. Wow, that would have been a quick drive to work since you're here at like 4:15. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was here. I was here three, what the heck, what time was I here? I was oh, like, here, it was early today. Oh, you today. were awake, you just weren't looking at the clock. Yeah, no, no, no. Okay. Right. I was, no, <laughs> I was, just, dude, I was here early today. <laughs> Um, yeah, so th it's kind of cool because we're moving into a new season and it's all about no, balance. What do you, how do you think about, uh, I think of fall as a new beginning. I don't know why. A lot of people think of it as the end of summer and the beginning of winter, but I don't. I, see I, it think, as, I think of it as both. I'm really sad that summer's over because I don't like the cold. But I always think that I'm most productive in the fall. A lot of people, they say even more than January 1st, we start our resolutions. Like people are cleaning their closets, they're making new plans, they're getting into fitness, they're doing cleanses. They're like, summer's over, let's get down to business. I think of the holidays that are coming. It's anticipatory, it's exciting. All of that is coming up. And then January and February, you just kind of go skiing. And then before you know it, it's, oh, it's April. That's how I think of things. And then summer starts Fall is your favorite again. season. Fall right? is my favorite season. Summer's I got to be honest with you. And some of the leaves, I was driving home from New York yesterday. You can already see some of the trees. The leaves are starting to change already. It's pretty crazy. And do you love, you've got your pumpkin spice flowing already? I, I have not had any pumpkin spice, but we are, learning, we are learning to make a great pumpkin craft today. So yeah. Amy, Amy is here. She's going to help us with that. We're very excited to do that. Um, you know what else is really good in the fall? What? A pot pie. Oh. When's the last time you had a pot pie? See, that was a big, ding, big thing at my mother's house. I love pot pies, but I can't remember. I haven't had one since I was a kid, probably. Is it Mrs. Smith who makes Mrs. the Mrs. Ca Marie Calendar. Marie Calendar? That's yeah, it, Marie I Calendar. I see him at the grocery store still. Oh, my gosh, but look at this. now. Or that and um, Chicken a la King. That was Chicken a la King in a can. <laughs> yeah. Nobody eats this anymore. Actually, they have a very good deconstructed... Uh, Pot pie at Vaughn's in downtown Hartford, yeah. the Irish pub house. They, they, they kind of pour it on the plate and they put the biscuits on top. But it is National Great American Pot Pie Day. And I just remember opening the top and everything was so hot inside, I'd burn my tongue every single time right. I would do it. So I'm glad it's deconstructed at Vaughn's because I can go there and not have it steaming, as steaming hot as it Maybe would be if it's covered. Maybe that's what you want to do to celebrate today. Yeah, mm -hmm. check it out, check it out. The 71st Primetime Emmy Awards were last night. And, you know, kind of a changing of the guard because really the, the streaming services are cleaning up. Amazon won uh, the most, seven nominations. There's Billy Porter, right? No, 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 that's not Billy Porter. I apologize. Billy Porter had another big hat on. So anyway, but he made history. Billy Porter accepted Outstanding Lead Actor for his uh, role in Pose, and he is the first openly gay black man to win for Best Actor in a Drama Series, so that was a moment. God bless him, right? Good for him. That now, is terrific. Uh, now, now the, so the, Amazon got the most, and then Netflix. Uh, so Fleabag? In. Have you ever even heard of Fleabag? It's I've on never, Amazon. Yeah, you've heard of I've never heard of it. I've never heard of it either. Because you don't go on Amazon. <laughs> no, but... Uh, <laughs> I, I, that's very true, although I might have to start. You might actually now. have to buy something on Amazon for the first time. That would be a story. Go to my Facebook page and tell me if you think it would be a good story if we teach Scott how to buy something on Amazon. I know how to buy. I have the app and everything. You have the uh, app? Yes. Yes, I have the app. Oh, my gosh. All, All right, right. So well, the Kardashians, the Kardashians had a moment. they got up and everybody laughed at them. Do we have the clip? Yeah. All so right. Roll it. Take, take a look. Our family knows firsthand how truly compelling television comes from real people just being themselves telling their stories <laughs> unfiltered and unscripted. Yeah, people were really laughing about the real people just having their real lives. Because moment. they are real. When I look for some like when I look for somebody real to idolize, I look at the Kardashians. You know, real. real. That's what I think of when real I think of and, real and people. And unscripted as well. I think of that. <laughs> That's what I think of. So anyway, the audience of truly famous people they thought that was funny. Yes, and Meghan and Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are in Africa, South Africa. Yeah, their first big royal trip since she's 
she's kind of been on maternity leave since May. She hasn't taken official trips. Doing but some really now, good things for charity. Yeah, and the baby is with them. Archie. Baby Archie's traveling. All right, it's a busy day here at Channel 3, especially as we get ready for our 4.30 news.